we have just made it and you guys just saw our new van that we just recently got guess what we're camping guys as you guys can see here we are guys this is our new car that we just got and we finally went camping guys so it is finally time to show you guys around a little bit and make a video so you guys can see the sun is trying to go down over there got everything set up over here hanging garbage bin so that way the animals can't get to it easily got the campfire going right my beautiful lady <laughs> yeah as per usual got our nice big tent set up i don't know if you guys can hear the canadian yeast up there but yeah that's a handicap man believe it or not that is a 2007 chevy uplander lt model let me go here and show you guys look at that isn't that nice or what yeah chevy yeah i know she's gotten a little bit dirty from us going up here but that's how it goes that's usually how it goes but anyways here we are i think we're gonna go down to the river down there and see if we can take some pictures of that uh, sunset. There's a deer coming. Oh dear. Oh dear. We got a deer coming. I don't know if you guys are able to actually see it. Let me uh, walk a little bit closer and see if we can actually get fairly close up to this deer. Yeah, I'll wait to go see that. Hopefully you guys are actually able to see it nice little white tail you see that it's right there oh yeah now you guys should definitely be able to see it that's for sure now she's gonna go in the bushes that's fine oh my goodness hey eh? who has shown up over here yeah oh somebody is drinking some uh, tea uh-huh yeah i know good it good morning yeah no kidding Guess what we're up to? We got the fire going up here. Uh-huh. We're cooking us some bacon and eggs up here. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. We got the nice fire going. And we got Diego's new car, uh, Jeff's new car. Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah, let's go check it out. And besides, guys, let me know how many miles do you guys think that this uh, van has on it, right? It's a 2007. I told you guys that yesterday. It has disc brakes and all of that. Let me show you guys. There's absolutely no rust on these brake calibers or anything like that yet. Really nice aluminum rims. Really nice interior. This is Jeff's new car right here. I figured I'd show you guys. A Malibu, yeah, really, really good on fuel, he says. It's actually better than what my Civic is. So here we are, as you guys can see, a beautiful campsite up here, isn't it? Look at that. It's gotten a little windy today and it's cloudy, but uh, who cares? We're enjoying our weekend up here. Heck yeah, just cooking us some good breakfast. So let's go... Uh, finish our breakfast guys and then uh oh yeah wife is uh taking over my job hey well i don't care <laughs> we got some uh some onions in here gonna throw some onions in there and all of that good stuff so we'll have us a good breakfast all right guys after uh a long walk up there on the sand trails and all of that
going back to the campsite and uh, guess what we're up to. Let's check this out guys. We threw on some baked potato, a couple of steaks. Ooh, look at that. Looking real nice and juicy, don't they? Uh-huh. Yeah. Hi. Wife is sitting there. Son is trying to go down a little bit. We, uh, we've had so much fun out here today. My brother came out and visited us. Now we're just sitting back and uh, drinking us a cold one. Mmm. Yummy. That's really, really, really good. So, anyways, I got to flip them bad boys. It's super windy here once in a while. So, got to use my mic here. So, you guys can actually hear me, right? It is the next morning, guys. I know we've been here for a good while and just enjoying our day right so guess what now it's time to uh just have a small little snack breakfast and uh then we're uh thinking about going for a hike as you guys can see we got some cinnamon buns right there over the fire pit Ooh, that is awesome and we got us a little bit of a wine right here nice and cold yes indeed Wife is just getting everything ready. Good morning. Yeah, so we're going to have us a small little breakfast. And then we are going to go for a nice little walk. As you guys can see, the sun is trying to peek through right them trees up there. I think we couldn't have asked for a better campsite than, uh, than this, that's for sure. As you guys can see, beautiful, beautiful up here. Trees all around us. Like you can never ask for anything better than that. A little bit of flies here, a little bit of mosquitoes, but that's how it goes. The river is actually right over there. So we're like a hundred and feet, 150 feet from the river up there. And there is like zero wind today. As you guys can see, man, it's looking nice up there. All right, guys, the wife is calling the birds. She's got the mic on now too, so you guys should be able to hear her. <laughs> and we are getting ready to go on this trail hike up here. But I figured I'd show you the beauty up here a little bit. Yeah, the trail is called the Marshes Lake. It's close by Spruce Woods Provincial Park. Uh-huh, some huge, huge trees up here. All kinds of birds and stuff. Beautiful, beautiful weather right now. A few little clouds. Oh, there's a bird flying right there. And we just saw one that's a black one like that with a yellow head. They're kind of rare up here in this neck of the wood. So uh, we're going to see if we can get some nice pictures of those. There's some butterflies flying around, some yellow and black ones. So the actual camp that we're staying is further that way. But uh, we saw this uh, or heard about this area here and uh, the uh, trail is actually over there, if you guys can see that right there, and uh, that's where we're going to go, and it kind of trails all the way around. This goes like in a circle like that, and comes back out over there, you can see our van out there, and kind of kind of just goes a circle, like the river kind of goes in a circle, goes all over the place, so let's go for a walk, sweetie. Yeah. Yes. Let's go up here let's and enjoy. See what we can find. Yeah, let's see what we can find and uh, enjoy the last day of camping. Just me and the wife, and uh, we were calling the Kingfisher is what it's called. We've been wanting to take a picture of that for a long, long time, and uh, so far we haven't been able to. We've heard a lot of them here. Yeah, we've heard them here quite a bit, but no luck. They're always very skittish. They right away they fly away. I see that butterfly right there. See if it's gonna land. There's some dragonflies up here. Oh, there's a duck coming in to check it out. But yeah, here's the trail. Beautiful, beautiful calm up here. Oh, there's a chipmunk up there. Oh, the one hey. with the stripes. Look at all the ferns. Uh-huh. Which ferns. Beautiful up here. Maybe I grab a picture of that guy. Before we decided to actually go completely into the trail, my wife decided to go call the uh, uh, ah, kingfisher. Fi kingfisher again. And she noticed this turtle sitting here on this log. 
So I went over here and took some pictures. If you look closely, there's two more right there. Uh, yep, mm -hmm. they're looking at me. Uh, what are you trying to do? This is a beautiful place up here, guys. I put my camera down for a second and take a look at this. We found this beautiful marsh area up here. Lots and lots of dragonflies up here. And on the other side, there is another body of water up there. And let me tell you, there's some huge, huge fish in there. Tons and tons of turtles in here. You see those yellow flowers right there on the water? I've been taking some pictures of those. And then I went over to the other side up there. I heard something uh, splashing in the water, right? And so I had to go check it out. And sure enough, I actually managed to take a picture of it. And it looks like there's like some sort of carb fish or something. A really, really big fish. And uh, they're in a feeding frenzy right now from what it sounds like. So I figured, well, I'll go around here and show you guys. Oh, there was one right there, I think. You guys see the water splash there? That's what it is. Yeah, look at this. Not sure exactly what this is supposed to be. I haven't actually read it. But uh, yeah, you guys can see that probably way down there. That's where the uh, fish keep popping up and splashing and stuff like that. So really, really, oh, there's one right there doing it again. Uh-huh, just absolutely beautiful. Really, really hot though. I am sweating. You guys might be able to see I am super, super, super sunburned already. And uh, my wife is over there calling the uh, uh, Baltimore Oriole. And hopefully we can capture that one. That's a beautiful bird too. So anyhow, I think we're going to continue walking this trail. I'm sweating like crazy down here. Super hot and humid today. I think it's supposed to be like up to 35 degrees Celsius plus no wind. Oh, it's hot. I can assure you guys, it is stinking hot out here. You guys see that? I'm sweating like crazy. Uh-huh, but I'm making sure I keep hydrated, right? Mmm. <sighs> but guess what else we are up to? We are cooking ourselves a stew up here. I'm sitting a good distance away, as you guys can see, because it is super hot, just as I showed you guys there a minute ago. But look at that, we are cooking us a really, really nice stew. We are starting to clean up stuff. The wife is just doing the dishes. She just went over there to get more water. Got some stuff outside of here, cleaning the van a little bit. And then we're gonna clean up the tent after lunch and all of that. And then uh, we gotta leave again, go home. Oh well, that's how life goes, eh? Fun always comes to an end eventually.